very good evening to you all. You are watching Wikinot channel with me, Sujit Bhar. Today we are going to discuss about the oral questions of microcontroller exam. First of all, the question is state the different features of 8051 based microcontroller. It is an 8 bit CPU which has Sys core and Howard memory architecture. Next one, it has on chip 4 kilobytes of memory that is you can call it as a PROM programmable memory and on chip 128 bytes of RAM. There are 6 interrupt sources. It has 2 timers as well as 2 counters. It has 4 ports. Port P0, Port P1, Port P2 and Port P3. It is a 40 pin IC with dual in package. It has 32 input output lines. Then the operating frequency is between 10 megahertz to up till 40 megahertz. By port 0 is multiplexed. In 8051 mic microcontroller, port P0 is multiplexed because in order to save the number of pins. Port 0 has lower 8 bits of address bus and 8 bit data line that is D0 to D7. What is the size of address bus in case of 8051 microcontroller? The size of address bus is 16 bits. Which architecture is used in 8051 microcontroller? 8051 has Sys core that is complex instruction set computer and it uses Howard memory architecture. What is size of data bus in 8051 microcontroller? Answer It has 8 bit data bus. What is role of reset pin? A reset pin, if we are pro providing VCC to this pin, then your microcontroller gets reset and it will start the execution of program from very first memory location. The note related to this is, if reset is pressed, it won't clear the memory. It will start the execution of the program from very first memory location, that is from 00H memory location onwards. What is the role of P0 and P1 pin in 8051 microcontroller? These pins are used as a, as a counter inputs, where the external crystal where the external output can be interfaced as, a, as an input. What is the role of external memory interface pins? Answer. In external memory interface, we are having three pins, address latch enable, external access and PSEN bar. So if uh, we will, I will explain all these three pins one by one. First, external access. It is an active low input pin. If EA bar is connected to zero, that means your controller is fetching the code from external memory. And if EA is connected to VCC or EA bar is equal to one, then your controller is fetching the program from internal memory. If next pin, description of next pin, that is ALE, address latch enable address latch enable port p0 of 8051 microcontroller is multiplex port which has lower 8 bits of address bus that is a0 to a7 and at the same time it has multiplex data lines also from d0 to d7 so in order to d multiplex address bus and data bus we have to connect the ale pin to ALE pin to the VCC. If ALE is equal to 1, we will get separate address lines and data line. And if ALE is equal to 0, we will only get the data line that is D0 to D7. Role of PSEN bar pin, program strobe enable. This is very important pin which is used along with the external access. In PSEN bar, 
This pin should be connected to the output enable of your external ROM which is interfaced with your 8051 microcontroller and at the same time EA bar pin should be connected to the ground that is 0. Which pins of 8051 microcontroller are used for serial communication? RxD and TxD are used for the reception as well as transmission of the data respectively in case of 8051 microcontroller. What do you mean by PSW register? What is the role of PSW register? It is program status word register which is an 8-bit register which indicates the status of the arithmetic and logical operations performed by your ALU unit or CPU unit. Then next question. State, size and function of following 8051 microcontrollers register. First. PC. It is program counter size 16 bit. Program counter stores the address of next instruction to be executed. Second, DPTR data pointer. Data pointer is a 16 bit register which can be split into two halves. Lower 8 bits is called as DPL and higher 8 bits are called as DPH which can be used separately also. Data pointer is used to fetch the data from external memory or internal program memory. Next register PSW program status word register which is also 8 bit register function it indicates the status of the arithmetic and logical operations performed by your, your CPU. It consists of various flags such as carry flag, auxiliary carry flag, bits related with selection of the banks RS1 and RS0, overflow flag and parity flag. Accumulator register. It is also an 8-bit register function. It is used to store the result of arithmetic and logical operations performed by your CPU. Next register. Accumulator register or you can call it as a B register which is used to store the result of logic result function. It is used to store the result of multiplication and division operations. Stack pointer. It is also an 8-bit register which always points at the top of the stack whose initial memory location or Stack pointer always points at 07H memory location that is nothing but the memory location of bank 1. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more such videos. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Happy Wikinoting.